Right now I feel like I'm tanning in my car. But enough of that, on to some real talk. Stop being Instagram rich. As I'm scrolling through my Instagram feed, I literally see hundreds of people that I know in real life becoming Instagram rich. What's Instagram rich? Instagram rich is when someone seems like they're rich on Instagram, but in reality, they're not nearly as rich as they make themselves out to be. Basically, they're trying to be cool on social media. I see uh, pictures of people driving Lexuses, BMWs, Mercedes, and I know they can't afford it because I know that they don't make as much money as me and I can't afford it. So if they make less than me and I can't afford it, then how can they afford it? Sure, they can buy it, but they can't actually afford it. So they're Instagram rich. Well, in reality, other people and myself are building ourselves to be reality rich. The point is this, don't go to the restaurant that you can't afford just to post a picture of it on Instagram. Don't drive the car you can't afford just to post a picture of it on Instagram. Don't buy stuff like clothes and shoes and everything that you can't afford just to post a picture on Instagram because you know what's gonna happen? Sooner or later, eventually, all of that stuff that you bought is gonna be worthless because the cars, the leases expire, the clothes go out of style, okay? The restaurants, you eat the food and then guess what? It comes out the other way. So sooner or later, all of that stuff that you wasted your money on is gonna be basically garbage and what's gonna be left is just your debt you're gonna be left with just yourself and your debt even if you're not in debt you will still likely not have any money at all so you will be virtually in debt because if you have three bucks you're not in debt but you're pretty much in debt because you can get rid of it like that. you can get into debt just like that so what what I want you to understand is before you look on your Instagram feed and you become envious or jealous of someone that just bought the newest BMW, think to yourself, if you know that person, can they actually afford it? Because a good portion of the time, the answer is going to be no. They're, and instead, they're going to just be Instagram rich instead of reality rich. And then what's going to happen is sooner or later, in three, four years, the lease is going to expire. They're not going to have any money left. They're going to be crying, crying, crying their way all the way to the bank. And you've been driving your Honda or your Mazda for a couple of years. And you're going to be laughing to the bank because you're going to have a lot of money in the bank. So that's what it comes down to. Focus on being reality rich, not Instagram rich. I'm telling you right now. You'll scroll through your feed, you're gonna see lots of people that are Instagram rich, and it's actually kind of pathetic because they're working so hard to seem cool on a social media platform. And I'm 29 years old, I'm almost 30 years old. So when I look at this and the people are my age, virtually my age, I'm like, what are you doing? We're not 15 anymore. You know, when you're 14, 13, 18, you can make choices like that because you can recover from them by the time that you're 20, 25, you can be in a great financial position again. But when you're 30 years old, 29, 35, 28 years old, and you're making a decision that's gonna jeopardize your finances, you need to rethink it. You need to rethink it, man or woman. That's what it comes down to, stop being Instagram rich.